the hate. Get the fuck off me. Ah! Run! I want that screw. What the f Come on! Hey, hey, hey. I know you're back here for some more Walking Dead. I see you. You already just creeping. You lurking? You just you just lurking on the page? Well, welcome back. You good? You straight? You Okay. What is up? What is good? YouTube is VTH and welcome back to The Walking Dead. 20K is coming. I know y'all see it. We, we just... We just creeping. We creeping up to 20k, bro. We just we're climbing, and it's just amazing, bro. Listen, if you're a returning viewer, welcome back. This is your home. You belong here. And if you're a new viewer, I know this may be, you know, something new, something fresh. But I promise you, you're gonna have a good time. All right, let's go. Everyone, all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine, and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Okay, so we're back here. Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Wait, time it out. I gotta go get my uh my decision based gaming bracelet. Hold on. See this this one this one right here gives me plus ten intelligence for decision based games. I gotta wear it. I gotta wear it, bro. I can't play these games without it. Okay. So we're back at the, um, what do you even call this place? I don't even know what this place is called. Is, is, is bro okay? Hey Lee, really gave that old man hell. Yeah, we got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? Oh shoot, I gotta go check. She's good, I think. I'm gonna go tell She's her a tough one right there. She's right. just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. All right. Lee, you got a second? Sure. What? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? I tried, though! It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. Right. You think you do when you look back on it, but in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. That's an S tier yes. answer, bro. Great communicate console. Try to let it go. That's a great answer, bro. Cause I really was feeling bad. I didn't know what to do there. I I'm pretty sure I could have saved him, but like. Y'all saw me with the mouse. I was there. I was with him the whole time. Um, okay. I need to find those keys. Clem, you good? You good, sweetie? Hey there. Hi. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Stay, okay. huh? Yeah, it wasn't much. I know, Clem. I'll see if I can find something else for you. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good. Okay. Despite the circumstances. Yep. What an awkward conversation. Alright, she basically just told me I'm talking too much. Okay. That was awkward as shit. You don't know how to talk to anybody besides um what's his name over there you know that was pretty pretty awkward bro what am i supposed let me talk to uh chet is that How his you name doing, glenn? oh glenn i thought his name was chet what's your next move i don't know i mean you guys seem okay what about your family yeah i i forget it man that's your business i hate feeling like i can't do anything i don't know the feeling man Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, 
People do crazy shit. I guess. Right. That's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. For sure, bro. You let her do it, you know? You said give her the gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? She didn't want to live. It was mercy. Mercy, man. I couldn't let her go on like that. We couldn't. You never know. You can't give up hope. I think it was over for her, Glenn. Yeah, bro. Try You're... to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, right. He's just upset that he didn't get the puss. And she had a boyfriend, bro. That's all you care about. She was about to turn, bro. And you sitting there just upset that I, I chose uh, for her to off. He's just so upset that I made her choose to... Um, I gave her the, uh, the gun, bro. You're... You're just mad about some some twang, bro. Relax. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yeah. Let's have a look around. Okay. Okay. Did I do something Jesus. stupid? <laughs> Oh my god, who is that? He just eat. As far as I can tell, he's all the care of And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Okay. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. I'm not going to, why am I going to do that? What? What's over there? That place is full of TVs and electronics. Okay. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they... I'm going to go do it. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Okay. That guy over there has the keys. Oh, shit. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, That's my we, brother? We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Oh, shit. need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Um, let me... I don't want to do anything stupid, bro. Hold on a second. That Think was a... you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Oh, hell yeah! Power's still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting somewhere. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dark Doug, nonsense might save a life. You're a fucking genius. It already hasn't. This nigga's a genius. I got a few of them to take notice. Damn, bro. Okay. Um. Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man. There were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Let's head back inside. Okay. All right. It looks like I, I can't do shit out here, bro. Who knows? Who knows the combination? Maybe it's uh. I know who. I know who knows. I know who knows. I know exactly who knows the combination because he's the one that locked it. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. <sighs> okay. But you're the one that locked it. Huh. 
Yeah, right. Who opened the gate? I'm gonna have to break the lock. No! Is there any other way though? Like, if I break this lock, we're screwed. Awesome. Okay. Now to distract those things carefully. All right. What happens if I open this gate? I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna open it. Okay. Can I move? Oh my God, duh. Okay. Why did it take me so long? Um. Throw it. Good, 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 shit, good, shit, good, shit. Okay. Now's the time. Damn, Lee, your bro is a. Be careful. Keep an eye hurt. out, will you? Y'all will not believe how long that took me to uh, realize to do with all of this. It's gonna be edited, of course, but y'all have no idea. Hey, bud. Yeah. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. No time for constant. Oh my god, I keep clicking off! Did you find them yet? Give me a second. There's no time for sentimental shit! Grab the key! Finish him! Go, go! It's okay, bro. It's alright. Oh! No, no, no. Get him, get him. Get him. Come on. Die. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry I gotta do this. I'm sorry. I love you so much, bro. You gotta die. I need that key. Don't get up. Don't make this any harder for me, bro. Please. I thought I had to do it again. I was about to say, I'm ready for it. There we go. Got it. Holy crap! Run! Shit. Go, Lee! Don't piss me off, bro. Oh my god. Damn! Go, 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 go. Okay. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I just killed my brother. I mean, he was already dead, but... I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Don't butter me up just because I'm about to say you're a dad, bro. That is a piece of shit. Okay. Let's get him his nitroglycerin pills. Oh no. Oh, shit. We gotta hurry. Oh shit. Are you serious? Who is this? I'm gonna have to grab that screw out of her back at some point, aren't I? What is this cutscene, bro? Oh shit, and the game is locked! Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back! Do it fast! I gotta get my dad out of here! I don't plan okay. on dilly-dallying! 
Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Okay. Hey, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. For sure. Right, Don't throw it. Anymore. That could have been the end right there. Three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Oh my god. Oh my god. What am I supposed to do? No! No, 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 no! Hey, Lee. If you don't make it through this, you should know Shut up, we're gonna make it! I think you're a great guy. Shut up, shut up! Doug! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know... That I cheated on you! No! I should know what? Huh? You said I should know... No! Doug? I... Are you sure? What? Oh, oh, shit! Oh, oh, oh. Go, go! Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on! Run! Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something really strong, okay? Okay. Oh my god. Ugh! Oh, stop! Get out of here, bro! Come on, Did you find anything? Oh my god. Look, look faster! Look faster, baby girl! Look faster! I'm about to die! No! 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 I found something! My dad's cane? Shit. That was really important to me. Okay. <laughs> Doug! No, 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 no. Are you s I gotta choose? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta go for a... I can't. She has the gun. Save Doug or Carly? She has the gun! I have to save her! She has the gun! Ah! Let's go! No! Get him off of me! Ah! Yeah! Ah! Shit! Oh my god. god. Let's go! You got Doug. Ah! Get off! Hey. Get the fuck off! Touch her! Huh. Run! I want that screw! I'm coming to fish you, son of a bitch! What the f Oh hell no! Did he do Wow! Let somebody else get eaten. Today. Let's thank you, bro! Especially a good friend. He just punched the shit out of me! Oh, I should let you die! me when I get the opportunity and God knows I will he's dead Where's that piece of shit at, bro? Who is that? Oh my god, where is he at, bro? Hey, go ahead. Disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. Columbus, what? To Atlanta. Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Gonna do what he has to do, bro. Your dad, though, I promise you, it's premeditated. I'm about to kill him, bro. 
I think that's the wrong call, but you gotta find your friends, but I don't want you to die. What should I say? I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. All right, bro. It was nice knowing you, dude. Okay, where's everybody else at? How's everybody else doing? Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah. For sure. Let me do. snitch. Let me snitch. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah. Earlier, I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. That was a we just met. Thing. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Oh! Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Okay. Wait, Lee? What's up? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Um, it was simple. You had the gun. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Yeah, um, it was a simple choice. You had the gun, he didn't. He didn't have a burner on him. Wait a minute, though. Could she have made it? I think I'm making the wrong choices here. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Bro. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. Why are you, you staring at me? I hate it him wasn't. now. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck. Uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay. Sorry. I'm sorry. There's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, sorry, bro. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we Finally can find came you another. To the realization that your parents are dead. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. No! I don't want to talk to you! This. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? No! Not really. Good. Stay away from her. Where everyone here knows that Lee Everett is a killer. And I'm not talking about those things out there. You hear me? I ask you a question, boy. Who are you calling boy? Then again, I wouldn't expect a convicted murderer to listen to anything anybody's got to say. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Oh my god, I hey, know exactly Lee, what to do with him. Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. For sure. We're lucky to have you. What's 
happening? Why the music going off like that? I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Right? Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. The music is, is it's not loud enough. I can't hear them. And they fucking fix it. Okay. To be continued? I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. Who are We're these from people? the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. Alright, honesty lied to Herschel. You and 36% of players lied. Okay, who would you save, Duck or Sean? You and 49% of players choose chose Duck? Okay, loyalty, side with Kenny. You and 48% of players defended Kenny. Why did I, why, hold on a second. Nobody, so like, nobody wanted to side with Kenny? I'm confused. Mercy gave Irene the gun. You and 45% of players gave her the gun. Okay, who would you save? Doug or Carly? You and 76 of play uh 76 of the players chose Carly. Okay, good. So I felt like I did the right thing. Okay. That was the end of episode one, I guess. On to episode two. Previously on The Walking Dead. I know who you are. Oh, I Watch got out. another good one for you. <laughs> You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly, you'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> okay, he didn't even <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. The bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody. Yeah, I remember this boy. one. This one got me hyped. <laughs> I'm sorry, Doug. I'm so oh sorry. My God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. See, I'm, I'm, I really want him dead. I'm so sorry. This is probably like the only character I've, I've never had a character that made me want them to be dead so badly. I want it to happen. And I feel like they're going to give me that choice. And I'm not going to be righteous about it. Three months later. Okay. Damn. Lee, you are so fire, bro. Who is this? Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well... That's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. 
Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. You don't take people's food. That's one rule. Yeah, no you're survival. right. Don't take I wish I knew for food. sure how much food we have left. Stop sticking your hand in people's plate. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I'll worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Hmm. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? He's got a heart problem. Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. No. Yeah, he, he punched me in my shit last episode. He thinks I'm a danger to the group and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. I don't care. Put me in the ring with him. I got a burner, bro. Or not even. I got this axe. There is no rules when it comes to survival. I don't care. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Okay, sir. Go ahead. You fucking idiot. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! Let's go. This bro thought he had dead eye. Only I do, bro. Not you. Who is that? Oh my Jesus gosh, is this a bear trap? Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off. You're man. making so much noise, Rabbit. stop. Maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Yeah, bro, Please. shut up. We gotta help. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. No, just you don't. You get him out. After you that, you can dad? or whatever. I don't care. Please. Gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. I got him, I got him, I got hurry, him. Please, hurry. Lee, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Shit, walkers. Okay, never okay. Leave. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. I got this! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! Here we go. I have to hack him. I have to. Lee, do something! I have to cut you out. No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! No! Try to cut the chain! No! Let's go! Let's go! Oh my god! Out. He's not good. He's, pa he's passed out. Oh my god. If he 
he's alive, grab him and let's go. We had to amputate, bro. I'm sorry. Now we got a liability on our hands. Behind you! Travis! Shit. Come on, come on, we gotta move! That's what you get. You're stupid. You're stupid for doing that. No! Oh my Oh my god! Did you Always start us off with the most stressful time, bro. Oh my god. These two are a problem. It's us. Don't shoot. Get the gates open. We've got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on. Come oh on. My God. Okay. What happened? Oh, what's going on? Don't have time to explain. Yeah, he, he wasted okay? no time. Into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. Shut up! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. Oh my god. We gosh. have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. Exactly. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <laughs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No. Clem, we don't have time for this. Come on, okay? You know, oh, you oh, wait, she's think trying to pull us. Okay, this no, she's group. Okay, but we can uh, make our like own it. goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. No, I'm not. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. Oh my, my god, girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Okay. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Please, bro. Sit your old ass down. You old octogenarian fossil fuel bitch. Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Thank you. Give me that shit. <sighs> we have four items for ten hungry people? Okay. Why is everybody counting on me now?
Oh my god. Alright. The kids eat first. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Yeah, sure. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Alright, the kids eat first. Hey, Duck. How about a little food? Give half an apple. Give piece of jerky. Um... Cheese and crackers. Here. Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! Clem? Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Um... Does it really matter? Uh... Okay. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. All right. We need her alive because she got the. Well, now we have guns, so. Um. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. I'm not sure that's the best idea. You gave Glenn your blessing when he left. Just asking you respect my choice as well. Yeah, but he was leaving to find his friends. Your family's right here. Right. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. Hmm. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. All right. I'm not giving shit to, uh, what should we call it? They need food as well. I'm gonna give one to Carly because she... Want something to eat? Piece of jerky. Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. Okay. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Alright. Um... I'm not giving anything to the new people. I'm gonna take care of my people first. That may sound harsh, but it is what it is at this point. Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. And then... I'll give one to... Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Right. I'll give one to, um... To Lily, bro. Even though I really don't like her dad. How's it going, Lee? From up here, it looks like you're playing favorites. Shut up! I was gonna come and give you some food anyway, bro. Relax. I don't want anything from you. Oh! Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. I don't care, bro. I, I, setting my well, ego aside. That's it. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? You don't get any! There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Oh my god, bro. 
Let that heart attack take him. Take him to the to the to the pearly gates of hell. Please. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? For sure. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Hmm. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. All right, I checked on uh, Clement. Clem and what's his name? I didn't check on this dude. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. Okay. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, um... Uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. Alright. They're good. Now it's time. What is At important? least the kids have something to keep them occupied. Okay. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Holy sh... Oh my god. Oh my god. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah. I just hope Kadja can save him. Sorry, there's, there just wasn't enough food to go around. I understand. Gotta be hard to make those decisions. Just get me next time. You ever miss the Air Force Base? Hmm. I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Okay, so he's Air Force? Really, it's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. Yo, take that rock and crack him, bro. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? For sure. Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Who's Larry or Mark? Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? No! Come on, Larry, no, give I it a rest. I like you, Larry! I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Is that what you told him? Yeah, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? I'm gonna beat Look, your ass! I don't care what it is. I but want it! got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Bro, is a lo he's a lost cause. He's on a time clock anyway, bro. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Kaja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem. Did I just kill him? What about the other kid? Oh my god! 
No! 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 No, exit, exit, exit out right now. There's no way that just happened. Absolutely not. That was some S-tier bullshit that was about to happen. Shit, Kaja! Get off of him, get off of her, get off of her, get off of her, get off of her, get off! The axe, hurry! Shit! Get the fuck off of me! Get the oh! Get off of me! Get off of me! Get off of me, come on! No! Give me, give me, give me, give me! No! Get off of me! Are you serious? What an incredible shot you are, bro! No! 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 Get! Get him! Use S to back away! Come on! Back away! Back away! Woo! Oh my god! Oh my god! You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd what you bring him here face? in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. What? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. You're lying. Wait. It's true. I swear it. Maybe he's right. I didn't see any bites. It would explain why there's so many of them. Jesus Christ. If you just so, die, and that's all it takes. So what, the infection shit. is airborne? One fatal car wreck in a family of five turns into a family of walkers. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Oh my god. Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But uh I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Okay. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. I don't trust them. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, that sounds good. That sounds what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Okay. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. I don't trust it's nice him. to get away what, from that motel for a while. No other this Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Um... 
Now is not the time. Well, I'm here whenever you want to talk. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty I'll messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? I'm a Where murderer. are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Lily. Runs a pretty tight ship. Her and her dad are ex-military. Yeah, she She's knows her shit. Really she needs to know when to back so off sometimes. Bro. How many people or you he... got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. I'm In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. I don't know you why Gary are always pulling this shit. I don't who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. And are. you guys were keeping it up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's not more. Yeah, and you know what? More we more. ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Damn! Oh my... Okay, bro! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on. Let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Okay. Well... We know what type of people we're dealing with. I don't know why these people are being so helpful. It makes my my trust issues itch, bro. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I saw I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Uh oh, it's Grandma. This is our mama. I'm Brenda uh, St. John, and mama, welcome mama. to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Um, we all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh, yeah, um, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We hungry. We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get Fishy, your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. 
it'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Okay. Yeah, something fishy about this place. I don't know what's going on. Mark, but Lee, is, why don't you really take a look open. around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. Right. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. Right. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you did enjoy, like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I will catch you guys in the next episode. Love you guys. Signing out. Peace.